of June. Well, an historic apartment building in Avondale just got a makeover. Right. Hayden Hall is on the National Registry of Historic Places, but it's almost all new on the inside now, thanks to a multi million dollar renovation project. WLWT News 5's Kyla Woods is leading the way with a look at the place where 114 senior citizens call home. Low income seniors have newly renovated homes. Mayor John Cranley and other officials welcomed the residents to the iconic Haddon Hall apartments this morning. Betty Whitfield has lived at Haddon Hall for four years and won't be leaving anytime soon. I will remain here. I love it here. It's my home. It's important that we rebuild it for the people who have been here. The renovation of these historic Haddon Hall apartments has been crucial not only for the city, but specifically for the Avondale neighborhood. And so to see this building, you know, re furbished uh, is going to improve the morale of this neighborhood and I think it's critical to the Reading Road corridor which is one of our biggest uh, corridors in the city. For state rep Alicia Reese it's personal. A close friend of her mother's fell ill and moved into Haddon Hall. She cherished her time there and wanted everyone to enjoy the rest of their days as well. And I wish she could be here today to see the investment that's being made to make sure that more citizens will be guaranteed a quality of life when they come here to Haddon Hall. It's a common thing. When I asked Betty what she loves most about the renovations at Haddon Hall, is it the upgraded security, the enhanced recreational room and kitchen? Not at all. For Betty, it's about the community. I've made a whole lot of friends. In fact, I believe the entire building. <laughs> all, <your friends. laughs> all my friends. In Avondale, Kyla Woods, WLWT News 5. The project will cost $12.4 million to finish up.